everybody welcome again to another video class this is miss fran and today in our class of today we're going to do a show and tell do you remember what is a show and tell exactly we chose something that we like very very much about the topic of our week and then we prepare a short presentation so for you to see this is what i did for my show and tell did you like it? Okay. So, our, uh, the topic of this week was insects and bugs. Through all the week, we studied different things about bugs. We studied why uh, they look like this with lots of hands or legs. The thing that they have here, do you remember the name? And uh, good. And also, where they live, what they eat, all these interesting, interesting things about the insects. So here today, I have three of them in big, big pictures. I have a grasshopper, I have a caterpillar, and I have a ladybug. And in short, <laughs> a very small size, a bee right here, and a butterfly good job so insects love to live in a warm weather so now that we're going through the autumn and then winter seasons they are going to go to sleep and take a nap until it is hot and warm again they have something uh, in common this thing is right here these are called the antennae. These ones are for them to feel when someone's coming, when an insect also is coming, or sometimes to smell what they're eating or to look for their food. Incredible, huh? They also have lots of hands or legs, if you want to say. The grasshopper and the ladybug have six legs the caterpillar has 16 in most cases and the spider do you remember miss spider she has eight so many they also most of them unlike for example this one they have wings the wings are for them to fly from one um flower or tree to other so they can find a uh, food so here we have that the bee sips the nectar nectar from the nectar from the flowers as well as the butterfly right here the grasshopper the caterpillar and the ladybug they crunch and munch leaves. They love to eat the leaves. We also studied the life cycle of the butterfly. Do you remember that we studied her and all the stages before? So for example, in the first place we have the little egg in which the, the caterpillar will pop out like, hello everybody, here is me, the caterpillar. This one right here is going to grow because she's going to eat yum, 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 lots of lots of leaves. And then when the weather is getting cold, she will go in a cocoon. Do you remember the, the, the storybook of yesterday? Mm-hmm. So right now, maybe there is a caterpillar that is going to sleep. After the days pass by and we have a warm weather again, we will have a beautiful butterfly. So, for me, my favorite bug is this one, the ladybug, because I love that she is red and black with little uh, dots on her back. So, 
I do hope that you like my show and tell and I'm going to be waiting to see yours. So you can tell me all the amazing things that you learned this week uh, about the insects and bugs and you so you can tell me which one is your favorite insect. So see you next week for more fun and learning and have a nice weekend.